Now, I never thought I would get to say these words. Light rail is coming to West Seattle. You make it happen. Chapter X3 is the next big step in creating genuine, high capacity, frequent, utterly reliable transit for this entire region. This November is our chance to finally what, do what should have been done a generation or more ago. And that is make sure that every person in this region has access to all that it has to offer without having to waste tens and hundreds of hours of their lives sitting in traffic. Uh, every detail of the proposal that's been put forward by the board is based on need. The need to serve job centers, education centers, communities uh, that are struggling with congestion right now. And above all, the need to connect our present with our future. So what, let's just talk about West Seattle specifically, okay? And it's also coming to Ballard, Everett, Redmond, Issaquah, Tacoma, FYI. Uh, in West Seattle, immediately we will begin on improvements to the Rapid Ride C right of way so that that bus system will be able to work much more efficiently while we're building the light rail. Second, we will build light rail to West Seattle, connecting to downtown and the entire region with stations at Delridge, at 35th and Avalon, and at the junction. And buses will be serving each of those three corridors, feeding the light rail line for all the people of the Peninsula. Third, we will through bus rapid transit the entire length of 405, and Joe McDermott and I made sure that, that bus rapid transit made it all the way to the Burien Transit Center, so they'll be connected to the entire region. And four, we will be laying the groundwork for future light rail connecting the junction to White Center and Burien, and then on across the valley to Tequila and Rancid. When I roll up this West Seattle, we'll be able to reconfigure much of the bus service that now uh, goes on that same route to be able to serve more people within walking distance of their homes, bringing them to that high capacity transit. With that, they will be able to access job opportunities throughout the region at small employers and big like Microsoft and Amazon and Boeing, reliably the exact time every time. They'll be able to reach uh, education at our region's colleges. Almost all the community colleges and universities will be connected as well as many of the high schools. They will be able to reach cultural offerings, they'll be able to reach CenturyLink Field, Safeco Field, and most important of all, Husky Stadium. You know that most important of all. And the dining of Ballard, you'll be able to get to Ballard in an absolutely predictable number one. So this is a once in a generation opportunity. Those who came before us screwed it up. We cannot make the same mistake. This region cannot continue to move forward if we don't have a way to get around. Please endorse Sound Transit 3 for this November's ballot. Thank you.